Hey guys, it's Vampire Mike from Sega CD Universe, and I have a funny, yet sort of somber story to tell you all. So, if you don't know, I'm a huge fan, it's bad but it's fun to me and my friends, of Plumbers Don't Wear Ties. This is the 3DO game, it's a full motion video game, but it's really more still pictures with weird selections, kind of like a choose your own adventure with uh, a tiny, tiny bit of nudity, but not really, and really stupid humor and bad acting. It's just, it's just really the epitome of a poor game with like a silly idea, and it's just, it's so bad, it's fun. It's like watching a a, a movie that's so bad that it's good. So that being said, if you watched, you know, Angry Video Game Nerd, he covered this a while ago, and he did a really great video on it, and most people know it from that. Um, I happen to own a copy here. An original, but a, a copy is just the, the term I'm using. Um, not in the original big case, but it does have the manual and the disc and everything. So here's where this story gets funny. My buddy Nicky Massey, who owns Captain's Corner, check him out on Facebook. He does wrestler signings. So when you go to a, a convention or an expo and there's a wrestler sitting at the table, he's the guy who got them there and he will, I guess, collect the money and then split it with the wrestler or whatever, however they work it. I've known Nikki since, I don't know, seventh grade maybe. We were very close friends when I lived in the Bronx. We moved, we got older, we kept in touch. We're still good friends, but we don't talk as much as we used to. So Captain's Corner. So he starts doing this a couple years ago. It really takes off. He makes all these connections. He's friends with all these older wrestlers who now do this as a source of income. Really great lineup of people all the time. Amazing. He puts on his Facebook that he's getting Jeannie Bassone. I'm saying her name like that because she's Italian. So I say to him, why are you getting the actress from Plumbers Don't Wear Ties? He goes... She's from GLOW originally, the gorgeous ladies of wrestling from the 80s. She's one of the original people from GLOW. I was unaware of that. He says to me, what the hell's plumbers don't wear ties? So I explain it to him. I sent him the AVGN video. And he's like, wow, this game looks crazy. So I said to him, you know, what does it cost if I mail you the, the, uh, the artwork from the 3DO game, which is kind of rare. I think it's over 100 bucks now for the game. Will you get her to sign it? I don't want it personalized, I just want it signed. I think it'd be really fun and really funny to have Jeannie Bissone's autograph on the 3DO version of Plumbers Don't Wear Ties. He says to me, don't pay me just yet. Don't send it just yet. I'm in the middle of a move. So that was my fault because I knew he was moving and I didn't keep up with him. So he was getting her this past weekend, Friday and Saturday. I thought it was in the future, like another week or two when I had a little time. He didn't reach out, so I figured I had time. I didn't reach out because I thought I had time. I didn't really have time. Very disappointing. <laughs> so I write to him, and he's like, listen, if you send it, like, overnight, or if you send it tomorrow, it might come. You know, he, he, he was optimistic. You know, if you send it Tuesday, it should be here by Friday. It's going from New York to New York. you think it would be there. However, mail has been the worst it's ever been. Packages lost all the time. Packages I send people that I sell things on eBay, like games, three, four weeks to show up. USPS has been atrocious. And I really, honestly, with the new baby and everything, I didn't want to start doling out money to do like $20 each way overnight. So I was like, let me let me just not do it. I, I don't even know if it's going to make it there. What if it makes it there and he's gone already and somebody throws it out? Then I just have a loose disc of the game and it's a rare game. So I don't do it. Kind of you know, annoyed with myself that I didn't keep up on. I'm not normally like that. I have a lot going on, doing a lot with the house and different things. And as I said, the new baby. Would you frigging believe limited run games they announced today at E3? Coming soon for Nintendo Switch, PS4, PS5, and PC. A physical edition of Plumbers Don't Wear Ties. I shit you not. That is the last game I would have ever expected anyone to port due to the nudity, even though it's censored, and you can, I think, use a code to uncensor it. 
and just how lambasted over the years the game was. It is ridiculous. What a weird ass coincidence that I'm about to send this out for Jeannie Bessone to sign. I missed the time deadline, pretty much, my own fault, and now they're putting it out on all these consoles physically. I don't know if I'll ever be, if I'll ever be able to meet her or ever be able to get this signed. Maybe I'll send this to my friend Nikki Massey. Maybe he'll send her this video and she'll feel bad and say, mail it to my house, give me 20 bucks and I'll sign it. I don't know. But I'm so annoyed <laughs> and this is just like the cherry on top. Here you go. By the way, it's coming back out. So what you have is, isn't special any longer, which is fine. I wasn't going to sell it. I'm not, I, I enjoy the game. I keep things I like. So just a funny, weird little coincidence. But plumbers don't wear ties. Check it out if you have a 3DO. You can burn it or because there's no protection on the 3DO, or you can wait for the Switch, PS4, and PS5 version. And please check out my buddy Nikki, his Facebook, and he may have a Twitter, I'm not sure, Captain's Corner. If you're into wrestling and old uh, stars and wrestlers and stuff, he gets really cool people, autographs, he does them online, you can mail him stuff, or not mail him stuff in my case, and just pay him for 8x10s that they have. Great guy. You will not be let down. Take off your damn clothes. Take your damn clothes off. Whatever the hell the guy says in Plumbers Don't Wear Ties. So anyway, thanks guys for watching. It's Vampire Mike from Sega CD Universe. Be good.